Hey guys, welcome back to another Exposed Tuesday. Today we're going to take a look at a module that will help us theme our expanded notification panel. And you may not think that's a big thing, but once you have it in, it's actually a very nice touch to our ROMs. So without further ado, this is TK. Let's check it out. Today we're going to take a look at a module that enables us to theme the top part of our notification panel when we expand it. You notice it's a little bit smaller here. When I expand it even bigger, it looks really nice. It just adds another accent to your ROM. Uh, and this is something that was unique to this actual module itself because it only really tints this part. So when you have it closed, it's still transparent. It still matches your notification, uh, the way your notification panel is supposed to look like with your launcher. But when you expand it, you got that nice little theme and it changes on, a basic, uh, on four times a day, basically. Let's go ahead and get into the actual module itself. Uh, we'll go into the Expose Installer itself. We'll go under Modules. Look for Zeus Contextual Expanded Status Bar. And we'll go back here. That's not what I wanted to go. Uh, man. And then um, that was YouTube uh, Notification Seek Bar, which we can look into later. I'm trying to test that one out. Uh, so go into the actual uh, application itself. You can customize the pictures themselves if you'd like. If you don't, it goes by the, the default theme that's built in. For you to be able to do this, you do need to check the box and restart the device. Uh, but again, it changes different point, at different points in time. Uh, and if you want to change things, you just go in, select it. It opens up your, your gallery application. You can go into your gallery and then pick the application or the picture that you'd like to see. Uh, we'll go back here. And I'll go back into this one. Uh, and again, if you don't, you just leave it where it is and just restart the device. Very easy, very simple module. It really works very nicely. Installing the module is pretty simple. Actually, up till the last update that I received for the module itself, I wasn't even able to interact with it. It was basically just does its thing and it just goes on by itself. It changes about four times a day. If you don't do anything other than just install it and check in the box, um, it will tint that the actual notification panel for you guys. And it will change four times a day, morning, afternoon, evening, uh, and night, I think. Um, and you can customize it now with the last update. There's a little bit of quirks here and there. I would recommend doing a reboot after you actually do change something so that you're actually able to basically just, uh, you know, get that update and change the picture to whatever you'd like. Uh, some of the thing I would like to see hopefully in the near future is a reset button as the actual option right now, once you change from the default pictures, the only way you can do it um, is just to basically uncheck the customization option. Um, other than that, basically it works pretty well and it works actually quite well. Um, I've updated from uh, the actual Expose installer for 79 to 80 and it still worked pretty good. So let me know in the comments below if you've used this, if you've seen this before or what do you think about it. Other than that, like and subscribe, let me know what you guys think and I will see you guys in the next one.